La Palma has been declared a natural disaster zone following a volcanic eruption that forced jets of lava and ash into the air on September 19. The lava flowed down the mountain, scorched its way across more than 268 hectares of land, forcing thousands out of their homes and destroying everything in its path, including hundreds of homes, businesses, and huge swaths of banana plantations before reaching the sea 10 days later. There have been no casualties and injuries so far. However, the impact on land and property has been considered tremendous. The banana industry in particular suffered from this great devastation, with a third of the banana production of the entire Canary Islands completely destroyed. As the white hot lava poured into the sea and acid fumes filled the air, what experts have said could cause irritation to the skin, eyes and respiratory tracts, possibly causing breathing difficulties. The risk for the local population, however, is much lower as stated by Ruben Fernandez of the Volcanic Emergency Committee due to the strong winds in the area, which is blowing the cloud of gases towards the sea. Residents in the nearby town have been instructed to remain in home confinement in order to avoid injuries from the gases. The authorities have implemented a 3.5 kilometer exclusion zone around the volcanic site, which also extends to two nautical miles out to sea. La Palma's airport has also been required to shut down due to the accumulation of ash. All flights were cancelled and only resumed operation on Wednesday, September 29th. In aid for those who were left homeless, Madrid has released 10.5 million euros, through the damage, though the damage has been estimated to exceed 400 million euros. The eruption could last for several weeks or even months, according to experts.